Hello everyone. We're going to do another part of all the games that I'm going to um, cover in alphabetical order in the PS1 Mini that I just recently modded the other day to add more games to it. So we're going to move on to the games that start with the letter A now. Starting with Ace Combat 2. Nabco and the same company that made Pac-Man and Tekken made in 1997. And it's um, a flight game just like um, Galaga. So, I don't think I've ever played this game before, so I'm going to have to give this one a try one day. So, and we move on to um, the sequel, Ace Combat 3, Electrospear. Namco made in 2000, um, the same year the PlayStation 2 came out. And it's also the same year the 2000 X-Men film came out with Hugh Jackman as Wolverine. And just like with Ace Combat 2, it's a flight simulator game. So I don't think I played this one before. So I'm going to have to give this one a shot. So move on to the next game. AFL 99. I, I don't think I've ever played this game before. Um, it's made by oh, EA Sports. And I think it's a, either a cricket game or I, I think it's um, English I, or international football since it's international football soccer though so move on to the next game which is air combat yet another flight game and just like with um ace combat two and three it's made by um the same company namco and it was released in 1995 the same year the playstation launched and it's one of the few playstation launch titles next to the first tekken game I don't think I've ever played this game before, so I'm going to have to give this one a chance, though. Okay, moving on now to Alone in the Dark, The New Nightmare. Infogrames in 2001. Um, and you know, when this game came out in 2001, I was only 11 years old that year. And back then, my mother would, absolute, would solemnly forbid me to play games that are rated M for mature. So... Um, we're going to move on to, and, and just like before that, back when I was a kid, my mother forbade me to play Mortal Kombat when I was a kid, so, and back then, since the game when I was re first released in 2001, um, and I was only 11 years old that year, my mother would forbid me to play this game, since it's rated M for mature, just like with Mortal Kombat. Alright, next game is Disney's Aladdin in Nasira's Revenge. Based off the a game, another Aladdin game that is based off the 1992 Disney animated film Aladdin, which is also one of, which is one of my favorite Disney films of all time, next to Toy Story. And um, I remember playing Aladdin on the SNES back when I was a little kid, and I think I played the Genesis version also. But just like in the Sega Genesis version of Aladdin, in this game Aladdin uses his sword. To attack enemies in this game. Just like in the Sega Genesis version of Aladdin. So move on to the next game. Which is Alien Resurrection. 2000 by Fox Interactive. And 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 I think. I, I, I don't think I played this game. Oh and speaking of. Uh, Disney's Aladdin and Nasir's Revenge. I, I rented this game a couple times. When I was a kid. So And we move back to Alien Resurrection. Made by 2000 by Fox Interactive. Once again, I never played this game before, so... And and just like with Alone in the Dark and A New Nightmare, it's rated M for mat Mature. And my mother would forbid me to play this game back then when it first came out, so... Okay, we move on to the next game, which is Alien Trilogy. Came out in 1996 by Acclaim. Um, one year after the PlayStation came out, and it's also the same year that Nintendo 64 came out. So, and um, unlike... Um, uh, Alien Resurrection, Alien Trilogy is rated K to A, kids to adults, and I think, or later, rated E for everyone, so, and it's made by Acclaim and developed by Fox Interactive, so I might have to give this game a try one day. And next up we have Alundra 2, Activision 2000, so, and you know, Activision was the same company that made Pitfall, and I've never played this game before. I think it's an RPG game, so I might have to give this game a shot one day. And next up, we have Anna Corner Kavas Tennis, made by the same company that made Pac-Man and Tekken, Namco. And it's also this, it came out in 1999. Um, and and you know, I think I, I don't think I'm that good with tennis games, but Mario Tennis on the N64 is one of the few tennis games I played. So. 
I might have to give this game a shot one day. And next up, we have um, Apocalypse starring Bruce Willis, a.k.a. John McClane from the Die Hard films, made by Activision in 1998. And I think it was based off a film, though. So, And I don't think I played this game before, so I'm going to have to give this another game a shot one day. And just like what I played, uh, just like in my other previous part of this video, I... I discussed Atari, the Atari Collection Arcade by Midway, released in 1996, and it has six classic games in one disc, and it has a sequel, Atari, I mean, Atari, Arcade, the Atari Collection 2, and in this one it has um, Paperboy, Gauntlet, Rowmasters, Marble Madness, um, and you know I have a thing for classic arcade games. Came out in 98 by Midway Hallmark Home Entertainment. So we'll move on to the next game, which is another... Oh, wait, here we have Arcade, the Midway Collection 2. Released by Midway Home Entertainment in 1997. It has um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven classic Midway games in one. So, um, and you know I love classic arcade games, so... I'm going to give this one a try one day. And we have Area 51, Midway 1996, um, the same year the Nintendo 64 came out. Uh, uh, and I think it's based off the arcade game of the same name and rated M for Mature. And you know, um, and, I, I, and just like with Mortal Kombat and the, some of the rated M games, um, back when I was a kid and back when I started owning the PlayStation after my ninth birthday, my mother would forbid me to play... Um, games that are rated and for mature. And that goes for Mortal Kombat 2, it's, even though it's rated M. Okay, back to Area 51. And you know, it's, I think it's based off the arcade game. Um, so, there you go. Okay, next up we have Armored Core, Sony Computer Entertainment 2000. Never played this game before, and I'm going to have to give this one a try one day. Um, let's see, we have Armored, oh wait, um, Armored Core Project, um, Fan... Tasma. Okay, now I can try to pronounce it though. So, it came out in 1998 by ASCII Entertainment. So, I'm going to have to give this game a try one day. And then we have, oh, this one Army Man Air Attack 1999 by 3DO. Um, and I think it's a sequel to um, the first Army Men game. So, and you know, um, um, and I don't think I've ever played this game before, so I'm going to have to give this game a try one day. And then the last game in the A section is Army Men 3D, 1999 by 3DO. And you know, 3DO is also a console, though, by Panasonic. So, and, um, and it says Real Combat Plastic Men. And I'm going to have to give this game a try one day. And I think this game also came out for the Nintendo 64. Well, that'll do it for all the games that start with the letter A. There was a lot of them. So, see you all in the games that are going to start with B.